Checking, one, two. I don't know if this is there. Maybe, I think it might be working now. Might be working now. <laughs> okay, I think we're good. It's my first, this is my first time, first time streaming ever. I was streaming for like two minutes. I don't think anything was happening for some reason. And uh, yeah, totally makes sense. It's good stuff. Good morning. How you guys doing? I am uh, unshowered. Probably information you guys didn't need or uh, want, but it's the truth. Okay, it's the truth. Uh, sorry, we took a bit longer to get back to this. I was uh, the past two parts. I felt were kind of slowish, and uh, I was like, ah, I don't. It's it's fine. It was fine, but now we're back and we're gonna finish it up. We might finish. Probably won't finish today. Maybe finish tomorrow, but we'll see how things go. Hey Trey, thanks, man. Appreciate that. Thanks, buddy. <clears throat> how are you guys doing? Unshowered, unbent, unbroken. <laughs> That'd be a good like uh, death metal album title. <laughs> <gasps> Greetings from Moscow. Hey, how's it going? Shannon, welcome. Kira Finway. Nice to see ya. Hero, welcome back. Glotz, Doric, hello. Bachi, hello. Fatcorn, hello. Hi. Hi, hi, hi. Martin, how's it going, dude? Fiending for more dead space. That's cool. That's cool. Hey, Kaz, what's up, man? Hey, Dimas. Australia, very cool. Oh, I, I want to go to Australia so bad, so bad. Uh, let's get a, let's get a little recap of uh, what's going on in our life here. Salvage the Singularity Core. Our best hope to escape the issue mirror is to salvage the USM Valor Singularity Core from its engine room. Now uh, we have a little we have a little bit of a problem. Uh, okay, never mind. The problem isn't that bad. We have some healing. We have some healing. I... Oh boy. I gotta turn this up. <laughs> What's up, Glotz? Thanks, man. It'll be easy from now on. Pizza Tower rocks. Pizza Tower? Oh, let's take this. This is huge. I only had to burn my face to get it, but worth. What's this? Old dorms. Isaac, we have a problem. The Valor's carrying a 12 megaton warhead. The crash hit the torpedo bay hard. I need you to handle that nuke right away, before something sets it off. Handle 12 megatons? You know I'm not a nuclear engineer, right? I don't need you to be. Just stabilize the warhead and eject it away from the Ishimura. Christ, Hammond. No one trained you to carve up monsters with a plasma cutter either. You haven't let us down yet. Uh, I'm literally carrying the operation. Let's be, let's be clear. It's the best game to come out in January? Are you guys looking at... Uh... Are you guys looking at uh, Phantom Brigade at all? Kind of caught my attention this morning. I know there's been a demo out. I have not played it. But uh, kind of looks like a hybrid between Battletech and XCOM. But then there's like a... It's kind of on this interesting little timeline where you execute your moves. Anyways, we'll, we'll just give it a shot. Bakuretsu, hey, what's up? Am I gonna stream the new Jedi game when it's released or do recordings? That's, uh, when is that? We still have a couple months for that, do we not? Or am I, am I wrong about the timing there? I'm not sure, that's a good question. 
I think... Actually, I actually don't remember. Whoa. Why is he glitchy? I thought he was I thought maybe he was the the regen one. Nope. The soldiers must have had stasis units on their armor. When they were turned, those units End of April, right okay. into their bodies. Change them. They're fucking fast, Isaac. Stay sharp. End of April. So we have some time. Uh, I don't know if I'll stream it or not. It depends. I have to look at the schedule of what else is happening there. I do like streaming those games because they're, uh... I'm not going to say they're on, like, Dark Souls level, but the combat is, like, it's fun to do live, but this there's a lot Commander of story Padigan stuff, too. To all so. hands. We have been boarded by hostile forces. Hostiles are aliens. Repeat, alien and extremely dangerous. All personnel to arms. Fire at will. Orders, eyes only. What does that mean, eyes only? Priority black. Commander F. Cadigan. Operation White Light, theater, Aegis system. Deep cleanse. CEC vessel USG Ishimura, that's us, is in breach of EarthGov system isolation order. Believed to have recovered marker 3A, true. Special Ops has confirmed the system but unable to provide planet location. Special Ops advisory follows. Exercise extreme caution. If marker 3A has been recovered, onboard infection is a credible threat. Shock point to Aegis system. Move to position out of local scope range and await signal from Ishimura to confirm location. Secure marker 3A. If infection is present, initialize sterilization protocol. Eurydice. Eurydat. <laughs> if infection is not present, initiate containment protocol Apollo. All personnel must, without exception, submit to full psychological examination during debriefing. I don't think that was part of my employment contract, but, uh, sure. Whatever you say. Okay, so we have... I'm seeing two of these, uh, power cells. We might have a little trickery going on. Hey, Trey, no problem, man. I, I didn't really intend on uh, streaming this early, but I woke up really early today and uh, not going to the gym today. So I was like, you know what? Let's do a little, let's do a little morning stream. Jeez. Stuck here, you guys. Why is it? <laughs> Am I hitting like stasis bombs or something? Stuck. Is this like a thing? Hello. Oh my god, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh, 
Guys, I can't get out of here. <sighs> we are stuck. Okay, excellent. I think we've only had that happen like one previous time. It's not too bad. Hammond said that there are dudes that had stasis packs on them. You guys are listening to Hammond? That would, that would explain. It would explain a lot. This is Commander Cadigan to all hands. We have been boarded by hostile forces. Hostiles are alien. Repeat, alien and extremely dangerous. All personnel to arms. Fire at will. Half a death. Yeah, that's fair. Let's maybe stay away from that area. You know what we're lacking here? Ammo. Bad. What do you need, sorry? Uh, can you move the camera up a little? I'm bad at listening. Oh, am I blocking some uh, text down there? How's that? Let me know. Okay, so I presume I need this for something. that one dead the whole time? What's going on? Mr. Clark? Hello? I, I must speak with you. Who is this? Dr. Terrence Kine, the Ishimura's chief science officer. I, I studied the marker for the church. I'm done talking to unitologists. But, but, but the planet won't rest until the marker is returned. You, you can't leave. Watch me. Maybe uh, blowing up that giant pus sack next to an unstable warhead wasn't the ideal uh, scenario there. Is that possible? Caution. Warhead unstable. Contain all explosive materials. 
Just kidding. <laughs> Let's not blow that up. Got him. Oh, we need this. Hold on. This is the end of the game. Okay, the warhead's clear. Damn it, this doesn't add up. If the Valor was just on patrol, why bring a nuke? And if they had a target, what's out here except us? Yeah, I know. I'm downloading a munitions report right now. I'll clear your route to the engine room. Grab that singularity core and let's get out of here. <laughs> We're nothing if not thorough glocks, that is that is correct. Any of you guys playing uh, Hogwarts? And if so, how are you enjoying it? I've seen a lot of TikToks, that's about it. Ooh, hello. You're loving it? Which house did you get assigned to? All I really know about houses, and it's probably not even super accurate, is like... Slytherin bad. Gryffindor good. In terms of like morality alignments. Am I am I right about that? Okay, let me switch back. This Do I plan on playing Atomic Heart? Uh, yes. Curious after I see Co Carnage announcement on YouTube. What's the, what's the announcement? That he's playing it? Or is he in it? Shooting range online. Caution. Live fire exercise. Now, why would I want to waste my bullets doing this? Oh, I wonder if that unlocks these. We're even caught. Yeah, he's gonna play it. Yeah. How did Yeah. 
get this guy to die pretty quick here. We got big problems here. I don't have any ammo. Quarantine lockdown disengaged. Oh, error. Shooting range out of service. Please contact maintenance. Okay. <laughs> really happy. We didn't shoot those, uh, targets. I- I literally thought it was gonna be a game of... How many points can we get? We'd unlock these lockers. Okay. We did- we did win the game, though. We did win the game. But we won. Good for you, Odd. Uh, for being able to not just play Vampire Survivors all day. <laughs> I- I- it's funny, like, I do kind of limit myself from playing it because, uh... It, it'd be very easy to get, like, way ahead. And, uh, I'm generally, like, if I sit down to play, which I will do today, later, um, I'll do, like, three or four episodes, probably. There's just always something else to do in there, so it's, yeah, it's really, I've been really enjoying that. I feel like I probably have another... Two weeks of episodes of Vampire Survivors before it runs its course, I would guess. But I'll probably add, uh, hopefully. I'll probably add uh, Phantom Brigade if it's if it turns out to be good. Is this? ain't gonna work out for me. No! <laughs> I thought, I thought I, I thought I had it. Thought we were gonna be, thought we had that one. Turns out, in fact,
Turns out it's way easier to kill them by just letting them be stupid. Which I admittedly taught them. I taught them that tactic. risky. I assume you're not going to dab with the PSVR 2. Luckless was asking me about that the other day. Um, I don't know. If there's like a, if there's some type of exclusive PlayStation title on there, I would check it out. I don't do I don't do a lot of VR games generally, as you know. Not to say that I wouldn't. Is there anything on there that would is cool or what? No. Somebody zap him. Okay, I got one. Seems like they're getting a bit stronger. Quarantine lockdown disengaged. 
come on. It wasn't just a nuke. They came loaded for war. Got him. And destroy. This was no patrol. They knew about the Ishimura. Someone knew. We were all dead from the moment we arrived. So the crew is starting to figure this out. A killer app like half like out half like out. the horizon thing seems neat you know that's the thing about vr the problem is that so much of it is like it seems neat like there's there's neat things but there's there's not enough full experiences like Half-Life Alex, right? Which was... Get to a store, I'm gonna make a bank. Okay. Let's use this to get over there and then maybe there's more boxes because it looks like I need more for this section. Oh no, I just need two. We can we can just keep trading. Tim, what's up, man? I like neat VR experiences too, but not enough to drop over 600 pounds on it. Yeah, bro, I, I feel you. I bought the uh, Oculus, the new Oculus thing. I, mean, I play Beat Saber on it. <laughs> it's like it's fine, but I could I could play Beat Saber on my uh, Vive, right? What's up, Rally? Wait, 
No. Did I? Did I miss a few? Yes, sir. Sure did. No. No. Oh, God. See ya. Someone get the door open. Chen? What did that thing do to you? Help me get him to the Kelly suit. It's not Chen. Shut up! What? Chen? No. You're with Chen. Holy shit. Hammond. Rerouting power. He didn't even what? think twice. Hammond vital vision flatlined. He Hammond's gone. Hammond shit. Oh my god. Failure. Who needs to save? Not this guy. He'll be fine, probably. Primary systems failure. Evacuate immediately. Warning. Primary systems failure. Evacuate immediately. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be fun. Warning. Primary systems failure. Nope. I was ho I was really hoping that the door would would uh, close between us. That was the that was the uh, intent. Good thing I good thing I jinxed it when I said who needs to save, not this guy. Which game is not currently in VR that you'd love to see? I don't I don't know if making games that aren't in VR into VR are the way to go. To be honest. Warning. Primary systems failure. Evacuate immediately. Warning. Primary systems failure. Evacuate immediately. Warning. Primary systems failure. Oh, this is not the gun that I thought it was. Heat 
I think like um what made Half-Life Alex really good was the fact that it was designed in VR from the ground up and like so many mechanics in the game like you only can do in VR and make it feel cool and it was for that reason Should I follow that guy Warning heat exchanger offline and just from what i've seen like of um games have been ported to vr and stuff Warning, heat they're way less offline. engaging and i feel like the movement feels weird that's another thing that vr Warning, needs to critical kind of nail i remember even like early days of of half-life alex it took a while to get used to it you're in there for a while you know Critical overload in main electrical grid. Critical overload in main electrical grid. Warning. Critical overload in main electrical grid. Warning. Engine contains failure. Probably asked about it tons of time. What do you think about Half-Life 3? Is it better with flat screen or should Steam wait for a better VR? Mm, you mean like if if they were gonna if they were gonna do it? I feel like if I'm if I'm them, I'm thinking. I'm thinking you gotta do it flat screen. So more people can play it. I think that would make the most sense. Oh, I remember this room. Do we have to puzzle again? Isaac, come in. I'm here. Fuck, that was close. Chen, Johnston, now Hammond. And I'm tracking movement from the Valor. I think some of those mutated soldiers made it on board. What about the Valor Singularity Corps? It's covered in blood. But I got it. Cut. I hope Hammond was right about that shuttle. He said it was on the crew deck. Along with every unitologist on the ship and their marker. You need to... Wait, someone opened the door near the bridge atrium? It'll get you to the crew deck, but who's left with that kind of clearance? Isaac, something's up, but we have to get that shuttle. For God's sake, be careful. We're all that's left. Is the idea that we're supposed to be thinking that person that's left is, uh, Nicole? Hey, Mel. Okay, we're gonna find his wig. Hold on. Never mind. Actually, I'm going to see if we have any... Whoa! Is there anything back here that we couldn't access before? Before we peace out entirely. Is 
It's part of me now. Oh, we're good. Here we go. Okay. Let's drop all this stuff. <laughs> Might die 77 more times, maybe. <laughs> then it's easy mode. <sighs> One can dream. Alright, what am I doing here? I'm selling. We've got five nodes. And we've got decent cash. Almost feel like just buying five more nodes or four more nodes here. Where's our uh, where's our nearest upgrade station? It's close. Let, let's go look at this. And we'll see what we have. Okay, our suit is currently maxed. I feel like we're going to get an upgrade for this soon to unlock the remaining nodes. This is definitely my preferred damage dealer. Melee attacks can knock enemies prone. I don't feel like that's that good. But... Let's take these. I don't think we need Rate of Fire. Maybe the extra Ricochet here? We do use this pretty regularly. We'll go buy the other nodes. I don't, I'm not gonna... Oh, actually, I forgot. We buy the upgrades. We buy the upgrades because uh, we get the free node. So you pay a little bit more, you get the upgrade, and you get the node. That's the way to go. I wish for, like, uh, well, laziness, mainly, that they uh, would put these benches next to the stores all the time. We'll throw some extra damage in here, too. Hey, Fox, what's going on? Which weapon ammo is the most given in this chapter? I don't... I don't know if it's like that. Um, it seems mostly random, except apparently if you put a, a gun, you remove it from your inventory and, like, stash it. 
then it's supposed to drop more ammo for that. Or maybe it just needs to be in your inventory, but... I just kind of roll with whatever it gives me, and it, it forces me to use all the guns, which is fun. Although sometimes results in some not-so-excellent deaths. Plasma Cutter only runs... Oh, Plasma Cutter only runs will give you Plasma Cutter ammo, so it's not bad. Oh, you're saying, like, if you just didn't equip any of the guns. Oh, yeah, he, sur he survived that. Makes sense. I, I actually feel like strategically, like, if we're talking hardcore, cool-ass gamers, that... Running just one weapon is is definitely the way to go, and it probably is the plasma. Gun. And then he dies by two hits. Then. Yeah. Cause you can pump all of your upgrades into one thing, and your gun's gonna just level so much faster and be stronger at its high range, quicker. You get only that one ammo type. Isaac, I'm losing you. Something on the crew deck must be interfering with the signal. I can guess what that something is. If the marker's active, shit. The crew deck is locked down, but the deck supervisor might have an override key. The last location I have for her is the gym. How long will it take to install the singularity core on that shuttle? Not long, if no one tries to stop me. Hurry, we can't leave the marker in their hands. <laughs> Running one weapon's the way to go, just like in Vampire Survivors against Boss Rush. I have some ideas for how I can how I can do that one. I actually was pretty happy with my first attempt there. Oh, that's the that master door. How'd joining that cult work out for you, Bill? Oh, you know. Drink the Kool-Aid. Now I'm here. Cool. Oh, this is not even the thing I thought it was. This must have been their little makeshift church. Or whatever you'd want to call it. Place of worship. Am I going to play Atomic Heart? Yeah, I would like to. We were just talking about that earlier. Yeah, it looks cool. I haven't played a, a heavily story-focused game like that for a while. I just talked about that, and... Right. The 
lighting in this game looks so good, eh? Like, this is really, really cool. basketball. Z-Ball rules. Use the Kinesis module to grab the ball and shoot it into the rings before the timer runs out. Beating each level yields a reward that can be claimed from the lockers. When the center of the ring lights up, target that ring for a score multiplier. This was in the original, right? pretty sure that there was a game like this. Oh, I see. Okay. So there's six of them. Did we get them all? Gonna try our best. Entering zero gravity. You son of a bitch. Interference. You know, it wouldn't have been so difficult if these guys weren't around, just saying. Are they going to spawn every time? So it doesn't matter what color I get this in either. Holy shit, Kyle. Holy shit. Dude. Man, that's so kind. Thanks, man. Okay, this is about to get ridiculous, I bet. Is there a way to tell which one is gonna get blocked, or is it always just the same one?
Z-baller. We're just going for the all-time Z-baller high score. I feel like some should give you more points. Like when they're lit up or something. Dude, Kyle, that's super nice, man. Thanks, dude. Thanks for taking away my depression on your videos. You save lives. Dude, that's like... Very heavy. I'm sorry that you're struggling with anything. Oh, they do give more points when lit? I didn't notice. Sarah Fox, thanks as well. Thank you guys. Appreciate that. I don't know if, you, if you're in the chat or not, Kyle, but uh, yeah, I hope you're well, dude. There it is. How long we've been streaming? We're at um, an hour. On YouTube, actually, you can uh, you can check the um, progress bar. Oh God! I can see this dude. It also says time streaming under the video title and channel name there. Oh, cool. Yeah, I didn't even know that. start the day yeah it's it's i i generally am right now just settling in to uh do a recording or something i built your shit it didn't work you're not gonna hurt anyone else <laughs> oh yeah this doctor's still on the ship too Usefulness. we need that mercer still alive mr clark I'm still denied convergence thanks to this ingrate. Mercer, wait. Tell me. I want to understand. What is convergence? But you already know. Dead or living, 
We all feel the Marcus to purpose. Don't you want to be reunited with the people you lost? I. Yes. Then why not with me? Mr. Temple has fused. Can't imagine why. So close. Everything. That has happened on the Shamora is just the beginning. When you put it that way, you and your marker can go to hell. I need to shoot. Am I blind? Don't answer that. Don't answer that. Okay, guys, where that? Where is this thing? <laughs> You're kidding. You guys knew that? You guys know that? I knew that. So obvious.
wonder what that translated to. I wish I could talk to you? Which corpse is telling me this? Okay. 60,000. Oh, that hurts. That's way out of my league right now. I guess we're just going to hold. I, Glotz, I did think about it right there. I was like, maybe I should sell everything. I feel like, what do we have? Uh, there's, there's, how many chapters? 12 or 15? worth using all of my health for? No. 12, okay. Well, I don't I don't know if we'll be able to even get there by the end. A moment's pain. Humanity's essential. Do not falter.
Got it. Come on. Might get kind of close if you go for three hours. We'll see. Oh, you're talking about like finishing. Yeah, I'm, in, I'm not in a rush, but we'll see. We saw power somewhere, didn't we? Nothing else in here. Toxic hazard cleared. Same one. Wait, do these wrap around to each other? Yes, they do. It's that door there, right? Do I yeah, there we go. There we go.
Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, we're back. Look at our sad savings account here. Man, I am tempted to sell some of this. But it's like, I'm so far off that I don't even think it matters. We'll just keep saving. Hey, Rebel, what's up, man? Yeah, it has been a while. Good to see you. Spitters, that's the most annoying thing because it interrupts your um, interrupts your animation and they they feel like you're doing tons of damage. Sensors laggy, they can only sense when Isaac enters the room. <laughs> yeah, weird. Oh boy. Isaac. Sorry, late shift. How are you? I, um... My mother, she's, um... Octavia? How's she doing? How's she doing? She's dead, Nicole. They both are. She killed my dad, then herself. Oh. Yeah. The church... Took the bodies before I get up. Oh my god. Hey Tor. Oh Isaac, I'm so sorry. Fucking oh, told you. Stop washing. Stop it. Just stop talking. You said she was herself again. You said she would be better at home. Trusted you. God. Hey, Mac Telecom now. You might as well have killed him yourself. She was better. 
You told me to leave for the Ishimura. You, you pushed me to... You know what? Go to hell, Isaac. Nicole. Nicole! Nicole! I didn't... Oh, God. No. Not her, too. Is this all the Isaac. artifact? It's me. Like messing with them? She wanted to talk. I didn't know. Sorry. I can make it right. I'm sorry. I can save us both. About everything. Hmm. Seems to be. Get the feeling it's not actually a space opera. Anything's a space opera if you try hard enough. Hey, indeed. Did you lose weight? You look so different. Uh, yeah, over the past, like, year, I have, yeah. We'll take that. Log retrieved. Is it recording? Can't miss anything. Versus cruelty. I was deciphering how the marker's signal affects the brain and how... Oh my god. Ah, Dr. Brennan. Let me guess. Terence Kine let you in. Shame he's not here. He didn't understand how this tragedy represents a chance to cure death. Go on. These creatures. Reanimated tissue, cellular immortality. I, I know we've never seen eye to eye, but I understand now. There's so many I should have saved. So you came to me? Because you've learned how to communicate with the marker. I'm so close. I, I thought it must have the secrets that I need. You are a woman of science, not faith. Leave the marker to me. These are your autopsy notes. Very thorough. You'll need them peer-reviewed, of course. And poor Terence isn't here to help you. Yes. There's only one man I trust now. Very thorough. Do we have this yet? Oh, we do. I'm gonna go do that now. Maybe I won't have access to this. I feel like down here. Oh, this is taking me way out. Maybe I shouldn't be doing this yet if this is taking me way out of this area. He 
he's missing out on a good game. Are you talking about uh, Hogwarts? Yeah, I just don't have I just don't have the time, and I want to start something that I that I can't finish or follow through on. Uh, I can't I can't play every game, you know. I miss I miss a lot of good games, unfortunately. But yeah, I've I've heard really good things. Okay, where is this? Okay, we went into the bathrooms. We went in here to see the video. Did not go in here. It's weird that we wouldn't try to say anything to her there. Don't you think? I feel like that's a bit bizarre. Okay, cool. We got lights. <laughs> That's great. Now we have all the other doors. So what did that do for me there? Getting getting through there, we got the gold semiconductor. I think that might be it though. Everything else was already open. Where is this freaking Oh, there it is.
risky sale of the day coming up. Engineers aren't the social type. How would you know? Have you met any engineers? In real life? I have. They're all annoying. <laughs> I'm just kidding. My friends, is this what you hoped for when you signed your lives away to the church? Does this carnage look like transcendence? I don't know what lies beyond death. Not anymore. Whoa. But I do know our lives are more than just fuel for convergence. If we work together, we can fight this evil. It's not too late. Please. Okay. The boardroom. Or something like that. I need a pass key. Eternal rest. Man, this is... <laughs> it's like so Scientology, it's not even funny. Referencing our pre-departure discussion, I'm blessed to report that the Vested have authorized a premium stasis capsule for you aboard the Church's Holy Fleet. Congratulations. Your generous donations over the years have already covered all post-mortem stasis and cryopreservation fees. While I cannot guarantee which arc will safeguard your physical body, all fleet vessels are designed for centuries of deep space operation and equipped with state-of-the-art defense technology, ensuring that convergence will proceed without interference when the holy hour approaches. I must reiterate that this birth is conditional upon your successful completion of your pilgrimage. Once the marker is safely delivered into church's hands and all electronic records have been appropriately amended, I'll be pleased to finalize your resting place among the church's most blessed, including Altman himself. Praise be the marker and its prophets. Hey, Zeratul, what's up, man? Thanks for the 18 months, man. That's crazy. Okay, personal log, D. White, first officer. Goddamn unis are running the ship. So far, I know for sure. Matthias, Kine, Mercer, Holt, Carrillo, Pitts, Reed, Maynard, Shond, Espeleta, Natividad. That many senior officers just happen to be marker heads? Can't be coincidence. I know a stack deck when I see one. Update, check some files. A lot of those reassignments started after Director Eckert got chatty with the captain. Since when does the C-suite give a damn about personnel? Hey, Zelchko. Any plans for what comes next in the channel after Vampire Survivors? Yeah, I've talked about it a few times today, but I'm looking to check out um, Phantom Brigade. And... Uh, oh, shit! Phantom Brigade and uh, Atomic Heart.
Why are there so many? Oh, this guy. Oh, this is, this is really bad for us, guys. blow up over there. When I, when I get overwhelmed like that, I just kind of I start panicking. As you, as you can as you can tell. Investor's guide. Planet cracking is quite literally the dismantling of planets and moons on a macro scale by dedicated vessels known as planet crackers. Entire worlds are fractured with gravity tethers to reveal the rich seams of valuable minerals contained inside. These fractured pieces of debris are mined, processed, and then shipped to their destination. You may have read environmentalist reports claiming the destruction of a planet can destroy an entire solar system due to the disruption in the gravitational forces that hold each celestial object in orbit. Some of the wilder reports claimed this causes the whole system to spin out of control or planets to smash into each other. We would direct concerned investors to the article Safe and Sustainable CEC's Pledge of the Health of Our Galaxy. Uh, for a detailed breakdown of the truths about planet cracking. The short answer is, planet cracking is perfectly safe and provides an essential service to Earth and the colonies. Out of over three dozen planet cracks, only one operation has met with less than optimal results. Only one. Critics often cite the Wainot, or Wainet, Wainet disaster 11 years ago, wherein a planet cracker, three supply ships, and a colony were lost due to a gravity tether failure. They rarely mention that since that time, CEC has strengthened relationships with our manufacturers 
committed to irregular crew training seminars, and implemented safety protocols to ensure a disaster of that magnitude can never happen again. Before each planet crack, the candidate worlds are carefully chosen for their mineral content, net worth, and safety uh, with which they can be dismantled. Here's the breakdown of planet cracking. Arise between two and a half and three year mark, depending on the progress of excavation. Once the ship's in orbit, preparation for tectonic, tectonic chunk extraction begins. As you can see, the profit margins of planet cracking vastly outweigh solely planet side operations. Okay. All basically super, super highly trustworthy stuff coming from the company that wants you to invest all your monies in their fantastic and totally safe operations. Razos just discovered this channel. I spent 16 hours watching Death Stranding in the last three days. <sighs> Thanks for the entertainment. Thanks, man. That's awesome. Death Stranding was really fun. We better save here. That was such a unique game, actually. Like... I wonder if people are still playing that. How have we not opened this? Did you play the director's cut? It woke the being in the core of the planet. The hell is that? Someone's drinking. Mercer calls it the hive mind. Nexus organism which controls these necromorphs telepathically. Have a good one, Vermeers. Humanity is finished. The marker. Amelia, she knew. She told me it would return the beast to its slumber. Okay. So if we return the marker to Aegis 7, it'll stop the outbreak? Exactly. But we need the shuttle to return it to the planet. You have a singularity core. And I can let you through. So what do you say? If it'll end this for good, Deal. Excellent. I, I, I can distract Mercer, but not for long. And get the marker to the shuttle bay quickly. Thank you, Mr. Clark, for helping me fix my mistakes. This dude's dead, right? He's going to be dead. He's definitely going to be dead. He might even die right here. What's he doing? Glitch for anybody else. I feel like uh, we don't always get to pick them up. Nexus organism. 
She was only a voice at first, but now she's my constant companion again. I'd forgotten how much her presence soothes me. And as always, she sees to the heart of the problem. The marker must be returned. Perhaps there's been some kind of accident, some severance? Did the marker and the hive mind always coordinate, or can the hive mind slip the marker's influence somehow? Regardless, if this theory is correct, if the two are now at odds, if the marker can quell the hive mind, it would cut the puppeteer's strings at a stroke. It seems obvious in retrospect these necromorphs have no intelligence, how could they, yet there's a clear rudimentary purpose behind their actions, especially the gathering of corpses. They're clearly following some drive to kill living organisms and gather biomass. But where does this drive come from? How does it command them? Do all necrophores converted by a marker share this bond, pack instinct, or is it the hive mind demonstrating a genuine telepathic communication, perhaps the first ever observed? How painful to admit that the marker's horrors still hold a fascination for me. Now I think I understand my predecessors, those who first studied the black marker rather better. The road to hell begins with unprincipled curiosity. Foolish, foolish, foolish. I should have known sabotaging the engines was only a stopgap. Are we returning to Earth? Is the marker falling back into the church's hands? Yes, Amelia. There are always alternate solutions. Always. Okay, I don't want to use any... I don't want to use any nodes here. Until, uh... Until hopefully we can find, like four more ruby semiconductors. <laughs> I could probably sell, like, stasis packs and stuff. We don't tend to use those very often. Actually, too far off. This also taking me down. This is taking me somewhere. Yeah. Hazardous anomaly detected. Son of a Quarantine activated. Now, at this point, should I be going to find this thing? No 
now install the singularity core on the shuttle. I'll come help you load the marker. Damn, Mercy's close. Hurry! Okay, maybe I'll do this first. Oh no. Are we glitched? The answer is yes, but not badly. <clears throat> Story-based games with a good story games become lesser and lesser in every new year. Yeah, I, I can see. I can see why, though. Like, I think games focus a lot on keeping players playing as long as as possible. And like a story-based game, you're gonna usually play once, maybe twice, and then you're kind of you're kind of done. Um, so I think it's harder to like. It's harder to get like a big studio to invest money in that idea if there's not going to be like a longer term uh, revenue source. But I feel also that um, a lot of this stuff is cyclical. And there's going to be times so cool how you like, like morse time almost i feel like it's just everything's hyper focused on uh multiplayer and stuff right now and that'll change i hope okay Singularity core replaced. Tentire shuttle engines to complete hardware installation. Uh, have you talked about this before? Are you watching The Last of Us? Oh, hell yeah, dude. It's so good. Um, episode 3 was like the best episode so far. Episode 4, I think, was short. I wanted, I wanted like, more. Um, but they did the... Um, like the sniper scene, which was really cool. I think the way that they handled um, Michael and Sam was really good. It's probably one of the like. Let me out.
Really? Actually, kill him. Okay. I feel like. I'm gonna need to get this jet pack on or something. Or this jet thing on. Is that a thing? Oh. You might think he'd be dead there. Am I trying to kill him while he's in here, maybe? bring it to the marker maybe maybe the marker will prevent it from Hold on. I bet just like that other thing where I've got controls. Probably have to get him into like no limbs there, but oh, nice. We had the right idea with the jets. I just couldn't figure out how to trigger them. Cool. Oh, that dude's. Hey, Revan, what's up, man? Thank you. Appreciate it, dude.
justice. Sort of. Stress environment. Mr. Clark. Mr. Clark, come in. Fuck this ship. <laughs> You're alive. Fuck Owen, this ship. Fuck Owen too. Kendra. I'm here. But every oh, alert on the Ishimura is screaming. Critical damage to internal systems. The marker just ripped right through the ship. Something pulled it down to the cargo bay. Kind. Fire the shuttle the hangar. Going after the marker. Of course. Amelia, quickly. Wait, Doctor Kine. That guy's lost it. He killed the captain. We can't trust him near the marker. He says returning it to the planet is the only way to end this. We've got to try. I'm heading to Cargo. You ping Nicole's rig and tell her where to go. Leave it to me. Thanks. When I get the marker, we're all getting out of here. Okay, can we get that rig now? End of days. Okay. Trial. This is, um... Where we fought that dude and froze him in the thing. Descriptive words, big boy. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, I'm not. No, not even. But yes, also. I'm trying to picture in my head, like, what door we've run into and not been able to access to get to this rig. Mr. Clark, we're approaching the hangar. We'll meet you there with Yes, I'm going to assume. We'll send the hive mind back into the darkness. So glad you gave that guy our only escape shuttle. <laughs> Isaac. The biomass is pulled down in the cargo bay. It's recombined itself into... Well, it's something huge, and the marker's embedded right in the middle. How the hell do we do this? I've got the Shimmer's cargo cranes. They can move half a bay of mining gear. No problem. If whatever's down there wants to wrestle for the marker, I'm in. Overwrite the safeties, and yes, it might work. But hurry. We're losing critical systems fast. Okay, guys, uh, let's do this. Chapter 11 just started. When we come back, uh, we'll go and do the rig, and I guess this too, right? And then we'll go to the cargo bay. Where does this show on the map? Uh, does that help me?
Oh yeah, okay. So if I track it, that's a little bit better. That might have been close a bit to where we were. Anyway, uh, we'll come back tomorrow and we're gonna finish. We'll finish the last two chapters. But uh, I'm gonna take off for now and uh, go from there. Oh, Sniff, yeah, welcome. You made it just in time. No, no, no worries. We'll see you tomorrow though. Uh, I'll go ahead and schedule the stream as well. I'll probably start at uh, noon tomorrow, so like uh, just under 24 hours from now. And uh, we'll finish it up. Guys, thank you so much.